I want to ask you about the Oscars. Obviously, there's been a lot of talk about the Oscars this year and some controversy. You, you thought that there's some movies that got overlooked. Is, are there any movies that you thought, man, that's a great movie. I think that should have been included. It should have been nominated, but it wasn't. Sure. Um, you know, obviously, Trainwreck. Um, and I'm not just saying that because Judd's here and I want to pitch him a movie later. <laughs> Why would I do that? Why would I do that? It takes place in an elevator. <laughs> um, no, I, I, it's funny because I don't, I don't see that many movies, but I saw, I saw this one movie, Tangerine, which was a, really, was a really good movie that I feel like didn't really get any sort of consideration. And, I, and it was this movie, it was shot on an iPhone, but if you look at it, it doesn't look like it was shot on an iPhone. And it's a story about transgender sex workers in Los Angeles, and it was really moving and funny. And I, I, the only reason I saw it was I was invited to a screening, and I rarely get invited to movie screenings, but uh, when I do, I usually say no, but this one was close to home, so I was like, oh, whatever. Right. And <laughs> How close to home, like? Like three blocks. Yes, yeah, so you could, <laughs> you could, you'll go to a screening if you can walk there. Yeah, so I went to the screening, but I didn't know anything about the movie, and so usually at those things, they make you do like press, and they have you go through a press line. So I was like, well, let me look up and see what this movie is, because I didn't know what it was at that point. So I went on the internet, and I looked up Tangerine, and there's a weird thing that the same time that Tangerine came out, there's another movie called Tangerines that also came out around the same time. And Tangerines was a very serious drama about two soldiers, one uh, Estonian and one Georgian soldier, who were trapped in a house together, and you don't know if they're going to kill each other. And that was the one that I did an internet search on. <laughs> <laughs> I didn't, I didn't read things quickly enough. It was three blocks away. I didn't do my due diligence. So I learned a lot about a Baltic conflict. <laughs> and then got to the press line, and the movie, the movie had premiered on Pride Weekend. And so this reporter came up to me and was like, this is a fitting movie to be watching for Pride Weekend. And I was like, wait a minute. <laughs> <laughs> Did you just blow the whole movie for me? Like, is this how the conflict gets resolved? <laughs> it's just like, we... I hate who you are as a person, but I love who you are <laughs> as a person. <laughs> mm. And so I was just like, I, like, I got really mad, and it was, I was this thing where I was just like, you just ruined this movie. And in my head, like, still nothing... I didn't, I didn't know there was another movie called Tangerine. And I see other people going through the press line, and there were a lot of transgender people going through the press line. And I rarely see transgender people in a press line, so I was like, oh, wow, that's really amazing. Like, look at that. Like, all these, all these people who are coming to see this movie, and I didn't realize that Baltic conflicts really resonated with the transgender <laughs> movie that way. Like, it was one of those where it's like, it's, I, I didn't realize, like, I, you know, it's a different Georgia. Yeah. <laughs> Did you, you have, we have, there's a picture of you on the press line looking completely confused, and this is real. <laughs> That's you just not understanding. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> I think that was, I think that was the moment when they were like, it's a different movie. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, it's still free, though. Yeah. Uh, and it was a great movie, and it should have gotten, it should have gotten some consideration. It will now. Uh, I don't think, I don't think anything wants a bump from me. <laughs> given, given the Grammy campaign I just did for that. I think you're in good shape. Hey, thanks for watching. Please subscribe to my YouTube channel so they will stop making me shoot these videos. Please.